For practice it, exercise 2.7 space numbers, we need to write nested loops for to produce the following output. We can notice that we have five lines of code, or five lines of output here, so we're going to need a for loop that runs five times. And we're going to say int a is equal to zero, and then we're going to run this as long as a is less than five. Actually, we can set this equal to one, that way we can use this to output every single time because we can see that our output is being incremented every single time. We'll do a plus plus and we'll have a for loop in case inside of this like this and the for loop is going to output these spaces and these spaces we'll call um, well we start with one two three four we start with four spaces so we'll say int b is equal to four and this is going to run as long as b is greater than a. And then we'll do b++. Once b is greater than a, we are going to stop printing out spaces because then we need to print out a number. So we'll do system.out.print. Then in here we'll have a space like this. Outside of this loop, once this loop is finished running, we are going to just print out a number. So we'll have system.out.print, and we are going to print whatever a is, like this. And then once that is done, we're going to move on to the next line. So we'll do, actually, we can combine this in one line. We'll just do system.out.println a, like this. And then we can submit it. And there is an error here. This is going to run for an infinite amount of times, and this is because we have b++ here. We need b to be minus minus, since it is eventually supposed to hit a to stop. And our output is incorrect. That is because there's no actual space here. There needs to be a space in between the parentheses and not just blank line. And it looks like we need to run this one more time, so we'll say b is less than or equal to and I think this equal sign has to be on this side. And then if we do that, we get the output correctly. So this is the code that will produce this output here.